Gemini, welcome into your tarot card messages for today. Thanks for tuning in and I hope that all is well with you, beautiful energy. Remember that these messages are for your entertainment. You may find some that are able, that's able to help you on your journey in some way. Something about Cleve or Cleveland with this card, the Hermit, Gemini. And the... Someone, the, the Ten of Wands on the bottom. Yep, the Ten of Swords and the Ten of Wands. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. And the Moon card. Wow. And the King of Swords. Oh, someone is being watched. Someone is being blocked. Someone is protected. So someone is watching you, spying on you, Gemini. Someone is also trying to prevent you from finding out the truth. Someone may be trying to affect your word, your your truth, your light, your eyes, your throat chakra. They don't want you to speak the truth. Um, or this is like an oath. Because I was getting something about the swearing in that you do in court. It's the one that goes, so help me God. Someone did not want you. Someone wanted you to go speak but they were they did they wanted you to lie <laughs> someone wanted you to tell lies or someone was telling lies this could be about rent this could be about a house yeah we have the ten of swords the ten of swords is a lot of lies yeah everything is fine they wanted you they wanted to like they wanted you they wanted to like tell lies on you or but and they didn't want you to protect or defend yourself because they think they have something over your head. They were. This could be about someone's significant other. W-I-F-E. Right? And they didn't. So they were thinking that you're going to. Yes. A hidden enemy moon card. They were thinking that you were going to like. Keep quiet. Not say anything. You know. Um, but your natural instincts was telling you that something wasn't right. But I don't trust this person. So maybe you don't trust someone. There's someone that you don't trust. Look at this card. Ten of diamonds is next. There's something about information, truth, and um, money, inheritances, property, investments, insurance. Someone did not want you to talk. You hear and there's like, Gemini, you may have an ex or someone like that that was like creeping. Something, on the something about being on the down low and nobody has to know. And I'm hearing, I should have, someone is thinking that they should have K-I, you, not, not the L, not, how can I talk? Yeah, so you just like, you are also being blocked from speaking the truth, like, from because this is the energy like it's obvious what i'm saying but someone just does not want you to speak out or say the truth they want you to feel bad for or humiliated with the ten of wands on the bottom of the deck not knowing yourself ashamed guilty feeling like if you speak the truth you're going to be doing something wrong or bad they want you to they just the intimidated they wanted you to feel pressured and depression ten of ten of swords is here and sadness, but no, this person is not going to win over you, right? You know what I'm saying? I'm just not using certain words. And they didn't want you knowing the truth. They didn't want you to know you have protection. I'm getting witness protection too. Someone did not, also did not want you to confess or just speak what you know, right? Yeah. But with the Ten of Diamonds, I feel a lot of your spirits are around you. Your angels, your spirits, your guides, and your vision. Like, if you tell the truth, you will get favors, is the energy. But that is something between you and your spirit team. Because I feel like you know that, you know, like say you know the truth, you know who was really responsible. You know who did the whole thing, who was the mastermind, who was behold, behind the whole thing. You know, we have the Empress card here. And you know why this was happening too, Gemini. You know the truth or someone knows the truth. 
and with the empress card i'm getting a judge someone is here like a hearing or clearing or something about someone's hair or this could be hair like you're supposed to inherit and gemini these people were they were i hear skilled they were getting together and and discussing things without you in the room they thought you weren't in the room right they thought you couldn't hear what was going on but you're skilled you're naturally gifted you're naturally beautiful you're naturally clairvoyant not naturally psychic some people they wanted to challenge your gifts they did not believe in your gifts or believe in you so they were they were setting something up in secret because they did believe in you let's say you're supposed to inherit the throne let's say this this could be your in-laws gemini i'm seeing a, a kingdom with the empress card right the ten of diamonds and you have hidden enemies or at least let's say you had them because you're protected from them they were spies they were lying and they weren't like they were trying to make people believe something about you gemini right they didn't want you to be th throned or crowned okay so even though you were supposed to inherit this because let's say someone passed away your husband and you were supposed to get some ruling position or you were supposed to get some money they were trying to the whole like family of that person was trying to get together especially one woman in particular and say they they should like they should she's trying to put thoughts in other people's minds about you right because she does not want you to get this thing no someone does not want you to get a listing someone does not want your name to be on a list there's something about your dreams your mind anything that this person was trying to do to you gemini is going to go back on them and then they're going to be really sad and really feeling bad and offended but this person cannot take this person they underestimate this empress they cannot take your place because it wasn't it's not for them and they don't know the might that god has em embedded in you they just saw your pretty face but inside you is a, is a piece of might that these people did not expect to be met with their match. No. You put up, a, you, put, you gave them a challenge because they thought that they outnumbered you. Because let's say it was a number of this person, your, your significant others, that's your ex, your um, in laws. One woman, especially, she was talking to the youths, the, bo the, um, like the young men, the siblings about you. Because they don't want you to inherit something. I'm getting something about a church. And the church has something to do with your dreams. But this woman, Gemini, she's coming to find out that you're stable, you're, you're self-sufficient, you have options, you can take care of yourself. So she's like fussing with herself and she's trying to create a fuss with you. She wants your attention. She wants you to be fussing with her. She wants you to like feel intimidated. She wants you to look around and give you her attention because... Like, I feel like when you do that, it makes, it, it it turns you into who she's saying you are. But you don't even know that this is going on and you're just being your real, natural, beautiful self. And this person is losing and you're winning just by you being you. You didn't even know that you have an op opposition or someone was your enemy. That's why the moon card is here because they're hidden. And it's like, yo, even though you're hidden... Even though they're, they are hidden, secretly working behind you, you're still winning. You're still outdoing them without even trying. I hear beauty magic, right? Because it's just you move from your heart and you have so much to do. While this person is like plotting against you, you're out there um, reading to the children in the fields. You're out there volunteering at a school. You're out there planting a garden. That's how much goodness you're doing on earth. While this person is still trying to say you don't deserve the throne. How can they convince anyone? Hmm? And there's someone that is trying to go out there and pretend as if they're doing work. Just so that they can get your attention. You, you can tell these people. People are not fool anymore. 
you know you're not you're very intuitive so you can tell when someone is trying to do something just to get your attention or just to get you on their side and this person is going to be disappointed because they, they're realizing that they couldn't convince you that all the manipulation they were trying all the way that they were the ways that they were projecting onto you it just didn't take effect yeah the five of wands they just wanted to unnecessarily yeah the magician i'm telling you i spoke it the magic the karma all the things that they were trying to project onto you none of it took effect because butterflies were still flying around you these could be people close to you that can actually see you they thought someone thought that you'd have turned out for the worst like you'd have gone insane you'd have like messed up or they were saying whatever they were saying but these people they're going to have to repent because what they were doing against you was wrong even if they were just slandering your name it was wrong so even universally the targeting was wrong universal laws whatever laws they were breaking rules and they're realizing now because they're seeing that something is returning onto them they can feel the pressure coming back you know toward them and they don't have any answers let's say you are going to school like this is a school of magic Winderdorf and one of them the enemy went to report you to the the wizard up top and because of that he you know there's attention on him because the wizard is the the wizard the shaman is the shaman he knows all things so this pupil the shaman asks this pupil a question about something now so they're going there's going to be a blockage to the way people can um impact you treat you or try to affect you or talk about you or bring you down they're going to be prevented from doing that they're going to have to show proof come with something so when this person is asked to prove themselves or someone is saying like the wizard would say to this person like right back at you like what are you doing for yourself they have nothing to say so someone is realizing their if that effort was futile but it is actually bringing attention to them because the magician now or the wizard the big wizard can see that there's something brewing here hmm. so they may even be more upset at you because they got themselves in trouble yeah you are the high priestess you are clairvoyant you're really rich you're real for real you're really chosen but i feel like a lot of people in this magic school they don't know that you are of the like royal blood you're of the kin but the wizard know you know what i'm saying the wizards and the shamans and the high priests they know but this all the rest of pupils they knew that's why they were all competing against you because they could sense that something was special about you that they didn't have and the, the shamans and the wizards knew that one day this would come to light you know gemini they knew that one day you would be seen like this yeah so now they're th they're saying oh something is brewing that's why you're protected you're you're telling you know why you're being seen more too because your talents are coming out your eyes are twinkling you're waking up to your skills your gifts you're getting you're making more money you're becoming more and more successful it's just becoming more obvious like you're not a duckling you're a swan but not exactly or it's becoming more and more that you don't have to work as hard for your for your magic to come true you don't have to do as more as much classes you don't have to study as much because you are a natural and there's something about like your father cause it's like there's something about your history where you really come from that makes you powerful maybe they don't want to tell these youths that you are a descendant of the avatars you're a descendant of the most high you're a descendant of christ 33 energy master key vibration you're here to do big things it's only that the masters they had to raise you amongst these people <laughs> they had to raise you with somewhere and they the masters are actually here for you but let's not get our heads too swollen gemini you know what i'm saying yeah so yes much love to you and i'll see you in the next one i hope you find some that inspires you and can help you on your journey take it easy out there all is well and all is within you